How's it going everyone? It's Gorilla Man here back with another farming simulator video and in today's video we are back on the Wisconsin Illinois border map and I'll show you here as you can see here we are still in the winter stages this is our second winter video um, it's the third day so we only have about six more days of winter left which isn't too bad then we got spring we can start cultivating everything again um, what we're gonna do today though is we're gonna do some light logging first we're gonna start with some hauling we're gonna use this brand new cat Kenworth right here, this diesel power uh, Kenworth. We're gonna use this with the cat low loader right here. Uh, we're gonna use that to haul our carbon fiber scorpion king. Uh, as you can see here, I'll just take a quick walk around. This is what it looks like. I got the tracked version. I know everybody loves the tracked versions. And then yeah, as you can see, all along the edges, it's all carbon fiber and black, which is sick. So we so we're gonna switch this one out with the old one. I already sold the old one. Uh, I sold it for like 172000 so we're going to switch it out with this guy. So let's just get started. Let's get hauling for that. There we go. And we can turn off our work lights on. We've got a fog light. Oh, we can tip the cab too? Oh, check that out. You ever got to work on the engine? Oh, that's pretty sick actually. What was the other one? Activate? Okay. Alright. So we're just going to... Strap this guy up, and we're gonna use it. We're gonna haul it down to the uh, Stanton Sawmill, which is our our area. All right. Ah, uh, and then can't forget how to drop this one. Uh, raise lower lamp. Ra okay, okay, we got this. So that lowers. Nine is the supports. Okay, we'll leave the supports down. So we need those down for now. Okay, all right, that's pretty cool. It throws up like little things, like little uh, things to block you from going over the edge. All right, let's pull this guy back. There we go. Let's do this in first person. Let's see if we can do it pretty, I think we can do it pretty easy. So yeah, this one, just the difference is guys, if you guys can't tell yet, just all carbon fiber, which is it's a lot cooler. I like it a lot better than the uh, the old black and orange one. Then I went with this cat low loader because everybody was like, ooh, get some American stuff. Because this is a uh, American map, but it had like the man truck and all that stuff. And it's not quite uh, American enough for some people. So we got the Kenworth right here, Caterpillar. That should be plenty. All right, we got it all strapped up. Let's lock her down. There we go. Now it's locked. Oh, dude. And the tracks move with us. That's pretty funny. All right, so. We're going to be making our way. Actually, we should probably whip it around. Let's, try, let's turn it directly around. We need to go the other way. And we'll take this over to the Stanton Sawmill. Who just says carry? I have not been on the inside. This looks like it's got a weird red interior. But yeah, we're just going to truck this guy over to the Stanton Sawmill. And then uh, maybe use it a little bit. Ooh, having a tough time turning there. Maybe use it a little bit um, for a little bit of... Uh, some some good login for us so let's see so we're gonna take a left here Ooh, we might want to cut through fields I can't see anything though because snow is just fresh snow covered the, all the grounds so I can't really see where exactly I need to go oh hey the snow's not spotting over there though so I can see over here all right so we're gonna go all the way down here to the left and around oh this is making it kind of hard to drive on actually it's kind of dangerous. This is some good ice road stuff. Okay, there we go. Whew. Maybe I can just set it straight now. Alright, looks like the Scorpion King is still good in the back. Can't see through any rearview mirrors other than these side mirrors. Scorpion King looks good though. And looks like our turn is a dirt road right here. Yep, there's a stop sign. Okay, we'll go through here. We're just kind of following the map now because there's nothing to show us exactly where we need to go. Um, yeah. this might, I think this is a dirt road, though, that we're on. What is this place coming up here? I've never been over here. Oh, it's a, it's a farm. You can, you can use this as a farming area. It's a little guy, though. Ooh, I don't want to get too close to the field. All right, so we're going to be... Where are we at? All right. So just about let's check the check the map 
Alright, we're just gonna... Ooh, okay, we can cut it up in between the, the grain elevators. So, and everybody, leave a, uh, leave a like below if you guys like the Cat Kenworth. Or if you want me to do something else, leave a comment down below and I can pick up a different... Um, a different semi for us to use to haul everything around. I like this one so far, though. I think it's handling is a little weird, but it's got a lot of, like, attachments and things with it. Alright, where are we coming up on? So, grain elevator. The, was this, Northern Plains grain elevator? Alright, so is this a, yeah, this is a selling point. The station grain elevator. It's got a lot of corn here. Alright, oh, uh, that is water. Alright, I think, yeah, okay, I think this whole thing to our right and left is water, so let's cut up through the middle here. Go along this path right here, good bump. Alright, we are here at our forested area. Um, if, yeah, if you guys haven't seen this yet, this is what it looks like. It's pretty pretty large actually we're just gonna oh there we go we're gonna cut through it oh doggy okay there we go there we go, there we go. where do we need to go to oh we need to cut to the left oh maybe this wasn't such a good idea actually okay we're just gonna need to turn a lot less because we can't maneuver through these very well there we go Okay, there we go. Now we're home free. There she is. There's our sawmill. Alright, so we're just going to uh, drop this guy. And we're going to leave it. Uh, I'll probably leave the cat here too, just for now. Where is he? He's over there. We'll drop this guy off right here with his fellow logging equipment. Alright, we'll throw our supports up. Drop the ramp. Unlock the load. All right, looks good to go for me. There we go. All right. We now have Scorpion King here. All right, guys, if you didn't know, the logging for this, I didn't realize how big of a moneymaker it was going to be, but logging in this game mode is actually... Shut the engine off. It's actually a huge, huge, huge moneymaker. Um, let's see. Let me shut off these lights. It's got to be on to shut off the lights. There we go. So let me shut them off. Maybe. I guess not. Okay, that's fine. Alright. But yeah, logging is... A, you make so much money. I think it's like $3,000 per log. So that one thing right there, I think that might be a little skinnier. But they make about $3,000 per log, which is really, really, really good. Alright, everybody. So now, after we drop that off, uh, we'll wait a little bit. I think we might go back and do a little bit of logging. But let's check on the cows right now. Because cows were getting low on food. Ooh, milk tank's at 15.07. So we need to figure out how to take our milk tank and actually like, drop it off and everything. Load milk area. So you load milk in from here. Maybe you just load milk... I can't remember if you load it into a tank or if you actually uh, it drops something like the sheep do. Let's see. Animals, animals. Okay. Cows productivity at to most eighty percent. However, seasons include increases in milk production in the winter and spring to make up for the lack of grass in these months. Okay, so it's not a huge issue that we don't have any don't have too much grass. Um. Wait, what was that? Animals only give offspring at a certain time. Oh, they get offspring in the spring. Cows produce offspring in the summer. Um, I'm not sure if we have it on easy or not. So we might, they might die. I'm not sure. Oh, that's not good for us. All right. Uh, let's go check them out. Let's go hop in here and check them out. See how they're doing. I figure out a way to get around here. Uh, let's run in. We'll just run in through the uh, through the barn door entrance. All right. Ooh, are they all outside still? Yeah, we got one on the inside. Straw looks go like it's going pretty good. 
Trying to see where they make their mess at, like where you get the cleanliness at. I feel like it might be right here. That's total mixed ration station. There's grass in there, is that where you do it? Yeah, there's the water tank. We should probably use that tank to transport milk if we can. Then where is our grass drop off? Right here. Alright, so where is our cleanliness at? I can't figure out where our cleanliness spot is at, everybody. Ooh, that's a little irritating. I have no idea where it's at. Alright, that's fine, that's fine. We'll just uh we'll just go take the milk back for now. Let's see how we take the milk back. I think we can do it. Uh, we'll just go grab that tank, empty the water, and do that. Alright, so let's go grab this water. Oops, let me fill up water there too. We'll drop off whatever we, whatever we have left in there that they can take, and then uh, I'll see if I can dump it somehow. Go. Can I unload any more? Nope, doesn't look like it. Ooh, there, oh yeah, I forgot we could open the cover. Tip side to the left. Or to the right, I mean. Back. We'll go to the side back. Alright, we need to figure out how to empty the current water in this tank. Can we end, open the cover? No, we don't want to open that cover. We want to leave it covered. Oh, hey, I didn't realize that there was a open gate right here. Well, that is very convenient now. I didn't realize that there was one there. I guess I've just been missing that the entire time. Alright, we're going to take this over and we're going to fill up all of our greenhouses really quick. Because we do have two greenhouses, if you guys didn't know. They're straw. I think they're straw. Both, both strawberry. Blech, I couldn't say that for some reason. We have two strawberry greenhouses. Um, let's pull up right here. Let's see if it'll take our water. Did I see something pop up, or am I just losing it? Yep. All right, we'll see how much these guys hold. Because I've never done anything with the greenhouses yet. But, hey, greenhouses would be a good idea to start in the spring. Get them loaded up and ready to uh, start producing. I feel like they would produce in the winter because, you know, they're greenhouses and whatnot. But, uh, maybe not. Oh, you can see it pouring out there. It should be pouring the other way, but that's fine. That's pretty funny, though. Oh, come on. Oh, guys, and sorry, I posted a video the other day for Car Mechanic Simulator. And I accidentally labeled it Farming Simulator. I don't remember how or why it happened, but it did. So sorry everybody to that, to all you guys who got excited when I said Farming Simulator 2018, that was my bad. It's gonna unload, stop overloading, there we go. Alright now I hope this will empty the tank completely, it's 9,000, I think this might take like 6 though which is the issue. Alright, 5, 4, Three, two, oh, are you kidding me? 48% left. All right. Well, then, let's take this back over to the cows and see if we can get this last little bit uh, squeezed out. They've probably drank 48 things worth of water since we've been gone. I hope they have, at least, because... We need to drop off the rest. Oh, they haven't drank anything. Ah, uh, okay. Well, it stopped overloading. Let's go back here then. And we'll see what happens when we try and grab some milk. All right. Go, we're backing up nice and straight. We'll turn on our menus. Refill. Oh, there we go. So it automatically converts it over to uh, to milk, I guess. It just like cancels everything out and switches it. All right, so now that we got milk, now we have to figure out our spot to sell milk. So milk sell point. Could be, we have the bakery. Missing milk cell. Okay, you see that down there? I think I see, I think it's by the DeKalb. Or DeKalb, whatever you guys, whatever, whatever everybody calls it. 
All right, we'll go down there. Oh, no first person. I forgot. I can't do first person in this. What are geese still doing here? It is the dead of winter. Some guy's able to grow crops right now. I think that's a that's a little weird. All right. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Excuse me. Let uh, me. Where's my horn at? It's a good truck horn right there. All right, so we're coming up right here. Yeah, it's right here by our other cell point. See, it says missing milk cell trigger, which is what we're going to try and sell on. Huh. All right. See where we are. Oops, somebody is driving the truck out. All right, sell milk area. Well, let's see what we can do. Let me just pull up right here. Yep, there we go. All right, we're selling milk. All right, so you get about, it's about a one for one on the milk. So you get, we got, we got about 1,500 and you got about 1,800. Let's just check the quick, uh, let's quick check this. Uh, there we go. Milk, milk, milk. Look for the milk side. What the heck, is that milk? What is that? Maybe, huh? Maybe they don't have one for milk in here. Ooh, what is that? Is that snow? There's like a lot of extra stuff you can sell in here. I should, I need to go uh, look at like the creator file and see what that guy says all about. It. But let's take this back. Let's drop this guy back off, and then I think we'll call it there. Uh, it's just a bunch of errands we had to run today. We had to drop off the. Uh, Oh, we bought the cat, and then we dropped off the cat and the new scorpion, the carbon fiber scorpion king, at the uh, logging area, and then we just got the, uh, we figured out how to sell milk, so for next season, um, I am going to break the seasons down to three days instead of nine days, by the way, everybody, if you guys didn't know that, I'm going to be breaking it down so it's a lot quicker, so we're flying through seasons about once every two videos, maybe even one video, actually. Um, minus the fall, the fall harvest, because those take a little bit longer. Maybe I should sell the man truck while I'm here, too. Probably wait, though, just in case we need it for anything else. But, guys, I think that's going to be it. We got a lot done, like I just said. Uh, next video, though, we will be doing a little bit of logging, probably most of the logging. Um, and then we'll be checking in on the cows. And that will probably be the last video for our winter, and we will be breaking into the spring. Um, spring we're gonna be doing some cultivating uh, no planting I don't think any planting. let me check what the uh, thing says oh yeah no no we can plant never mind we'll be cultivating and planting and then all of these yellows are where we'll have to wait about a two week span or end up being a two day span for us um, on the harvest season so that'll be good good for us and great for you guys let me see I'll go drop this guy back off at my house See, I just noticed my house is also green. Did not know that before. But everybody, thank you guys for watching. If you aren't yet subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Like the video if you guys are liking everything that's going on. If you like the snow and the seasons map. I I love the seasons map. I think it's really cool. It adds another aspect to the game other than just planting, harvesting, planting, harvesting over and over again. Which I really, really, really enjoy so far. Just took a little bit of getting used to, a little bit of learning. But everybody, thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in the next Farming Simulator video.